What's going on everyone? It's Reese here and I'm back from holiday. I got back on Thursday morning but I have uploaded until well I'm actually recording on a Sunday. I don't know if I'll update update it today or tomorrow. Upload it sorry today or tomorrow. Um but yeah, so you can see there on the screen we've got Costa and Vidal, but they're nothing to do with a video. I'm actually trying to make a I forgot what team oh yeah, an extinct FC what Bateson on Bateson87 does on his YouTube channel. But the two players we are going to be talking about are two cams. One was bought for very cheap and is very good so far in the league. A lot of big YouTubers have been talking about this. So the first one is Payette and some people might know what I'm going to talk about today but if you don't, the other one is Ozil. So the question is today, is Payette better than Ozil? This has been asked a lot over the last few weeks as Payette has just moved to the BPL. So yeah, in, to be honest, you, Spencer FC thinks that Payette's the better player. Hugh Wizzy thinks that Ozil's the better player and a lot of other YouTubers have been more even. Um, some people think Payet, some people think Ozil. It's more Arsenal fans who think Ozil and it's more not Arsenal fans who think Payet. Um, so I'm going to talk about it today. I'm a Neva fan. I'm, I am like West Ham better than Arsenal because I'm a Manchester United fan. And to be honest, I don't know. Um, so we're going to talk about the stats really. Uh, Ozil was bought for something like 37.5 million and Payet was um, worth about 10. If I get these stats wrong, it's just because I've I've just tried to remember out of out of uh, my head. Um, Payet got a, how many cards did he get last season? Uh, not including his West Ham card, of course. One, two, three, four, five. So that's five Marseille cards. One upgrade. So Ozil got only three. So. So, technically, Ozil is the better player. Well, no, sorry, Payet is the better player in FIFA standard because he's got more, he's had more cards, his original cards. So, he's had a left mid version, he's had an upgraded cam version, uh, two in forms, and he's also had a team of the season. So, yeah, technically, he is the better player, but I'm not quite sure, to be honest. If I had to lean to a side, I'd probably go Payet. Um, I might do another video at the end of the season saying who is the better player because then we will have a better view. Payet's in his early days in um, the BPL and Ozil is quite far on. In, he's had about a couple of years and we can all see Ozil, he is a good player. He used to play for Real Madrid, I mean, pardon me, if you used to play for Real Madrid, you've got to be a good player. I mean, look at Di Maria, he, whom, he moved to United. And then everyone put all this pressure on him and he went really bad. Look at Torres, he was one of the best players in the world and he's turned bad. Um, I'm trying to think of others to be honest. Shevchenko, he's a really big one and uh, that's all I know to be honest. But yeah, so these two players, I'd have to lean to the side of Payet just because... He's scored, I think he's already got two goals and two assists in four games or something. Something like that. Uh, and Ozil is yet to make a massive impact onto this season yet. So, so far, um, because Ozil has, these are the highlights of Ozil. He's played for Real Madrid. He played for them for about, how old is he now? I'd say he played for them for about five, about four years. And that's pretty good. He was in the starting lineup most of the time. Payet has only played for Marseille, he was very good there and he's probably even better at West Ham. So, to be honest, I don't know, but I'd have to lean to the side of Payet just because he just because he, he looks better whilst he's playing, he's, he's more attacking, he loves to get forward, he's great at passing, he loves an assist and not a, he, he loves an assist and he'll also try and get a couple of goals a season. Um, he's as you can see there, Munson Ozil has medium low work rates. Work rates don't really mean all, but to be honest, they're pretty accurate for FIFA. 
he's he's not really a hard working player. Everyone says he is, but to be honest, when he's trying to defend, he's not a hard working player at all. Yeah, he's, he's a cam, but still, even cams, they're playing midfield, so they should at least try and get back. Uh, so yeah, I I know I've said it about a hundred times in this video, but I would say Payet is the best player. So getting into the extinct FC, I've got Costa Vidal, and I'm probably gonna buy Schweinsteiger, who's also extinct. I was gonna use Shakira, but I couldn't quite fit him in. I don't know if I can fit him in. I'm gonna try, but yeah. Apart from that, um, that is the video. I hope you like the video. Like, subscribe, and I. And I'll see you guys next time.